Hey sweet friends, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new here. My name is Bethany. Here on my channel you can find lots of cleaning motivation, lifestyle videos, mobile home updates, Bible journaling videos, all the things. So if any of that interests you, I would love it if you would give this video a thumbs up and hit that red subscribe button. Today I am just taking you along for a morning with me and the kids. I usually start out by making the kids breakfast. That is the first thing I do because Usually once they wake up between 7.30 and 8.30 in the morning, they are ready to eat. So I will start them something for breakfast. Sometimes they have oatmeal, sometimes they have yogurt, sometimes they have pancakes or waffles. But today I asked them what they wanted and they wanted yogurt with some fruit. So I went ahead and made them both some yogurt. I cut up strawberries and bananas and then I put some blueberries on there as well. And then I topped their yogurt with granola and they really love that. My kids are really big breakfast eaters so they will eat a big breakfast and then a little bit smaller lunch and then they'll eat really good again at dinner time. So I usually give them a good bit for breakfast and they definitely eat it all so hopefully if you're a mom of young ones this will give you some inspiration if you are in a rut as far as what to do for breakfast or lunch. We do a variety of things and if you're ever curious um, what we do eat, I can leave that down in the comments or maybe I can share that in another day in a life video of like what they eat for breakfast and lunch if you need extra ideas. So I hope that you guys are doing well. I know I've been posting very sporadically here on YouTube lately and it's just been a really busy summer so far and we've been trying to enjoy all the family things. So I've just been trying to post whenever I can get a video filmed but I'm hoping to get on a better schedule really soon. But I hope that you guys are all doing well. You'll have to let me know how you're doing down in the comments. I would love to hear from you and chat with you. Alrighty, and now that I've got them their breakfast and they're sitting down eating, now is the time where I'm going to make myself a coffee. Sometimes I don't have coffee. Lately, I honestly have not been having coffee because hot coffee has just been just sounding so terrible to me lately, but I have been seeing in my friend's grocery hauls, uh, Tiffany from Small Town 6, if you don't know who she is, definitely check out her channel. Um, I have been seeing in her grocery haul she gets this Stoke coffee from Aldi, so when I went to Aldi I went ahead and picked it up because iced coffees have been a lot more of my thing lately and with being a stay at home mom I don't get the chance to get out to get a nice coffee so I went ahead and got some of this in my grocery haul and then just added my home creamer to it with some ice cubes and it is so delicious and just so much better in the summertime. So once I get my coffee going and the kids are done eating breakfast, I will go ahead and lay out their clothes. It is cooler here today, only 70 degrees, so I'm just going to put them in some pants and put them in some t-shirts because um, the high today is only going to be 70 and when they were done with breakfast it was only like 65. So I wanted to go ahead and put them in something a little bit warmer today. And then once they're done and dressed, and playing, I will take a little bit of time just to tackle the breakfast dishes, get them put in the dishwasher. Some days I let it pile up until after lunch to be honest and just do them all at once, but today I wanted to go ahead and get them done. I had some family stopping over and I also had a grocery order that I'm going to share with you guys, so I wanted to go ahead and get the kitchen all tidied up. Yeah. 
A common sense is caught up with my confidence But my wicked heart still battles my intelligence But why do I allow that? Why? I'm moving along I finally threw away that little lock and key The one we found in San Francisco on Pacific Beach Tell me why I want it back Ooh, I'm back Ooh A little flicker in the wind Could set the world on fire Ooh Sometimes the hardest part is fighting with your heart's desire When it never dies And now that you're gone I miss you, so I hope kitchen I'm gonna go ahead and also wipe down the counters just to get those nice and clean and then when I am done cleaning up the kitchen I'm gonna go ahead and sit down for a minute and get on my computer and start a mental health Mondays video by Shiloh Eckrich she is part of Jenny Weaver's core group that I have joined with my church friends we all have joined this core group and jenny weaver does classes in there as well as shiloh and they are just so motivating and inspiring and so many tips to just get through your days as well as learn about the bible and these mental health mondays have just been so wonderful she talks about all things mental health but how to deal with it with jesus and not just the um, medical side of it. She talks about both sides and I think that it is just so helpful. But now we're going to go ahead and move on into the grocery haul. I picked up some of these chicken cordon blues for um, dinners, a pound of Colby Jack cheese, and then I also got two of these original sausage patties. One of these we are taking camping with us on a camping weekend. Two heads of broccoli, a cucumber, a big bag of cherries. We love cherries. I got some mayo because we were almost out of that. So I got some mayo and then I got the kids some of this juicy juice. I also got a big box of the variety chips. My husband likes to take those for his lunches for work. Some life cereal and some of these Sunbelt Bakery <laughs> granola bars that I dropped. Some Star Crunch and then the sweet corn. 
I got three Honeycrisp apples as well as some peaches. If you guys have never tried corn on the cob in the air fryer, you have to try it. So good. Um, but I also got some Johnsonville summer sausage and a couple containers of organic strawberries. Some of these pudding snacks. I thought they'd be fun for the kids. Another juicy juice. A couple um, containers of lactose-free milk. Graham crackers for s'mores while we're camping as well as some fruit cups some k-cups for the keurig i also got some pistachios my kids love them and so does my husband i got some buttermilk ranch and then onion powder and garlic powder and holy moly the prices of spices has went up um, coffee creamer and then heavy cream because i want to make some homemade butter again some bread and some burger buns and then last but not least i got these airwick um, little scents for the house but that's going to be it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed i hope that you will stick around for the next one i hope you all have a wonderful and blessed day i'll see you in the next one bye y'all